Hello, Sea White, Sea White's 89. Fucking Wendy Williams is at it again. She just put her fucking foot in it and fucked up and had to apologise and now apparently she just loves to do this. Um, this has to be deliberate at this point. First off, she, um, well most recently, she was making fun of children with cleft palates, which is fucking disgusting. And then she was telling gay men that they will never be women. Uh, and that they shouldn't dress in women's clothes or any feminine men or trans men who want to tra cross dress or or be women or live as women or whatever they shouldn't do it they're basically trying to take from women and she was disgusted and offended by it so and she had to apologize for that because the stupid bitch realized oh most of my audience are gay men um so but now, I think this is probably the worst, actually. I'm not sure what's worse. This or, or the children with cliff, cliff palettes. Um, Drew Carey's ex-wife died. Um, she had a fight with her boyfriend, um, and he she fell off a balcony. I don't know if he pushed her or whatever. But um, her name was Amy Harwick. Herwick? What was it? Harwick. Amy Harwick. And Wendy talks about her and uses the phrase come on down, making fun of the fact this woman fell from a building. What is wrong with this bitch? Does she want to, is she just trying to cancel herself? Does she, is she like working too much and needs a break? I mean, I'm so fucking offended. I, I, I had to make a fear. I jumped on, I've got horrible skin today, but fuck it. I just had to say something about what? But I don't even have anything to say because it's just fucking speechless. Wh how, why? Would you make fun of somebody's death, somebody's wife, ex-wife, somebody's fucking daughter, somebody's sister or whatever? I mean, why would you make fun of somebody's death and, and when, when there are people mourning for that person right now? And what possible benefit do you think you're going to get from making a joke out of somebody's death? Um, she, the, she, This woman apparently wasn't anything to make fun of, she wasn't anything, she didn't do anything to anyone, she wasn't one of these people who's a horrible person that people are like happy they're dead and making jokes and stuff, this was just a normal person who who apparently, I don't know if she had an abusive relationship or if it was an accident, but she died because she had a fight or something with her boyfriend and she fell out of a, off a balcony and died. I don't see how that is funny, I don't see how making fun of that is any benefit to you except for the fact that it gets clicks, it gets attention, it gets media coverage because you're not supposed to do that and any decent person with any freaking class wouldn't do that but Wendy apparently needs attention that much and no I'm not giving her attention because I'm nobody if you're watching this you're one of the few um, but I just oh, I mean the cleft palate thing fucking made me cry when I was thinking about little children who might be watching that and basically have see this person making fun of them on live TV. That was disgusting. And then what she said about gays, well, gays can take care of themselves. They're adults, they're not children, so it wasn't quite as bad. But still, it was just baffling that she was biting the hand that fed her. I mean, I know a big part of her audience is probably women, but I, rec I reckon the rest are gay men. Um, and she basically told them that they, yeah, they can't be... They'll never be women. The, a, a, that they're trying to be women. They want to be women. They don't, they're not happy with themselves. They hate themselves. They want to be women. But they never will be women because they don't bleed. They're not real genetic women. So they'll never count. That, you know, and that, that offends her that we try and take that from women. So, ah, oh, what the fuck is wrong with this bitch? What the fuck is wrong with this bitch? I am fucking... Can we please just cancel her? I thought cancel culture was so bad now you only had to say the slightest wrong thing and you were gone. What happened to cancel culture? This is one time it would benefit, like, humanity. Please. I'm done. I just... Yeah. Ugh. Feel free to share, like, comment, tell me if you actually hate the bitch too. I'm sick of her. I do not want to see another... I mean, what's she gonna, what, what is she going to do next? I mean, God...